What's up guys, it's Leroy Jenkins here for another video, of course, an update video, which is also not really an update video, a first responders coastal heat video, and of course a Roblox video. All these videos combined into one video. And today, guys, of course, we are here in first responders coastal heat, reviewing the brand new, which is not really brand new because I'm a bit late to it, but you know what, you guys haven't seen yet, and I haven't done an update on it yet, so just in case... You haven't played the game in a while. It's the FDNY right here. Not the tiller. It's the rear mount right here. Bam, boys. FDNY Ferrera rear mount. So, bam. Look at that. Ladder 26 looking really, really nice. Let's see. Does it stay as ladder 26? No, it's ladder 243. Nice. But anyway, as you can see, guys, the FDNY has a brand new ladder. So let's go on ahead. Let's test it out. Let's see just how tall it is. And you know we're going to test it out? Oh, there's a car crash. Somebody couldn't keep control of their vehicle. Yep, we're about to pass that same exact area. But yes, let's see exactly how tall this ladder really is. Right now, dude, the, man the maneuverability of it, absolutely amazing. You know, it's speed nice. You know, the moving left to right is nice. Everything about it is really, really nice. Bruh, this dude's putting out the fire of his own truck with his own tank of water all right but here it is guys our official building test grounds to the left here let's uh let's go through the light here of course we got to turn on our lights speaking of lights let's actually look at them we have times four instead of times six look at that beautifulness man oh it looks so good oh my goodness look at that. you even got the little flash look at that it's like the little flashing things where the lights go in a circle oh it's amazing but anyway, let's uh, go on ahead. Let's park up here and uh, turn on our warning directional lights right here. And uh, let's see how tall you go. Can this thing meet the top of the building? Can you get to the top? Oh, yeah. Speaking of which, we should probably put on, our, of course, our black bunker gear and, of course, our modern helmet. And there is the EMS going to the EMS call. All right. Let's see. Oh, and there's somebody else going. Oh, there. look at that little car. All right. Let's get in here. Let's also turn on the scene lights. If they, Do they have scene lights? They do not have scene lights on here. Interesting. Well, now we know. Hold up. Maybe it's in control. Scene lights, scene lights, scene lights, scene lights. Any scene lights? No scene lights on this one. All right. Well, now we know. You're going to have to have other engines on. Uh, whenever you're having this engine respond, you're going to need other engines to be in the area. Or a, of course, uh, what's it called? Where is, where is that? That one's okay. We'll go there after. But yeah, we're going to have to have other engines respond or have an ambulance on scene in order to see. But let's go on ahead and uh, put these out. Look at them. They're coming out with the little uh, flashers on the back so that you can see. They're only in the rear. Interesting. Uh, they're not in all four areas. But let's see what we got. Look at this thing go. Oh, it's so good. Okay, you know, we're going a bit too high. All right, let's go on over here and extend out. Time for extension. Do you meet the top of the building? Oh, does it get there? it let's see i'm missing it going it's going inside let's see oh yeah it go oh my gosh this thing goes up high look at this thing man whoa well guys at least you know dude this thing can do this thing can go way above the look the rung look where the, these two different ladders there's a whole extra ladder on this thing which is able to go way up super high I mean, given that it's station 20 in the FDNY when, you know, there's basically skyscrapers everywhere in their entire station, it makes sense. But still, dude, this thing, look how tall the freaking, this isn't even a tiller. It's a ladder truck and it's tall, dude. So guys, now you guys know, bro, you got, oh God, this thing gives you the height of a tiller without even having to get, you know, the bad maneuverability of a tiller, dude, because the thing maneuvers amazingly, right? absolutely great okay can i do it myself please because you're going a bit too slow come on down 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 there we go all right now let's head on over to that fire yep put these in look at that it even has an animation for going back in and nope i want you to reset and perfect we're good to go off to the fire now let's see how code 3 driving is because you guys already know that control driving versus code 3 driving is very different all right let's back it up and for those of you guys, if any of you guys live in New York and hear the FDNY constantly, is this the siren that they use? Because that is one other thing that has to just, it's just part of it. It has to be a proper siren. Let's see. 
Is this the siren that they use, guys? Anybody that lives in New York, let me know. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. All right. I already know where it is. It's not a very tall building where this fire is, but however, it is still a fire. Let's go on ahead and respond here. Code three. And here we are. Look at it. There's only one extra place left. And guess what, guys? Guess who they're calling for? They're calling for the ladder truck. Look at that right there. Smack dab right there. Look at that. That's what they need. They need a ladder truck. That's why they couldn't get to this final piece of fire. And they got it out. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Using that teamwork to make the dream work. This. Oh, my gosh. This is amazing. Look how many people we have here. I'm also blocking the intersection. I'm going to move my truck. But I like seeing this, dude. I like seeing huge, huge fire responses. Can you wait? Just wait. Literally, just wait. Just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait, literally. And I'll move out the intersection. There you go. Look at that. Now you guys are feel free to use up the entire intersection. Just put on the parking brake. We're not even going to move. Look, we're not moving. If they hit me, then that means that they're in the wrong. I am not moving at all whatsoever. I'm basically a parked car. What, what is this guy doing? What is wrong with you, man? I've been parked here. All right, let's go. Now we can finally leave. Dude, there is no fire. You guys need to relax. Just go back to the station. Here we go. All right. Adios, amigo. What is going on there? The lag just out of nowhere. My goodness. What? How did my car catch on fire? Well, let's see how good it is. Let's see. Uh, can I put out my car like that other guy did? No, I cannot because I don't have an attack line. My guy, you're going to have to put out my, my car, please. Out the, the, the glorious, the glorious, bleh, the glory of lag. Put my car on fire. All right. Hey, buddy, your car is moving. Let's see. Let's get that. Uh, where is it? Attack line. Way down here. Boom. Let's go, man. Let's go. All right. Let's see. Let's attach you and time to put out the fire. There we go. Perfect. Fire is out. Oh, your car is moving, man. Your car is moving. There you go. Let's, can, I, can I get rid of the attack line, please? Get rid of the attack line. Let it go. Right here. Right here. Let it. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. There. We're good, right? Oh, and his car's gone. Okay. Now we're good to go, right? Can I go back in here? Or we, oh, using a tow it. All right. Well, that was good while it lasted. And who just has their siren blaring? The guy inside of there does. This ambulance. Oh, my goodness, dude. Actually, it's not an ambulance. It's a one of those. It's a mid-mount. Can you please turn your siren off, man? My goodness, that's loud. All righty now, guys. Time for the final test. The most... Wow, I already damaged a vehicle. The most dangerous test, and that test is the speed test to see just how fast we're able to go on this highway. What's the maximum speed this baby can put out? So let's turn on our thing going code three to an imaginary call. Let's see how fast you go. All right, we're going 70, 80. Oh, 80 seems to be the max, right? 80 is the max. Yep, 80 is the max. And 80, what's it called? 80 studs per second or 80 miles per hour? You are actually able to be pretty mobile. You know, you're not skidding all over the place like you are with some other place, like uh, with some other uh, what's it called, engines and you know tillers and all and so on and so forth. So yeah, bro, the maneuverability, dude. If you like being able to just move, just being able, this thing is completely and utterly drivable. It doesn't skid. It doesn't do any of that silliness. You know, it just is able to go wherever you go. You want to say go left, the thing will go left. You want to say go right, it'll go right, right when you need, dude. The I don't know if it's the tires or what type of thing they use to get this but it is app look look the stopping dude it's able to stop on a dime my goodness dude it's just able to be moved look at that i would have crashed into it if it was any other truck i would have crashed into this dude all right let's go can i can i go past you no okay you're just gonna block up the whole road good to know man good to know oh it's a good thing we have that good old suspension yo why are you messing with my truck yo relax relax dude Let's go. All righty now, let's get over to this fire car right here in South Beach. Here we go. Uh, you guys are going to the South Beach fire, right? Here's open. Okay. Is it a shop fire? Oh, it's a shop fire. All right, we're good. All right, well, speaking of shop fire, let's see how much water this thing is able to put out before it goes dry. All right, let's stop it up. Let's get out. Attack line. Let's go. Uh, let's see. Attack hose. Nope. Attack hose. Why is it that whenever I click, the mouse goes somewhere else? Attack hose. All right. Perfect. 
Let's see how much we got. All right, and boom. Started down. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, we're able to put... How many fires are you able to put out? You're able to put out this fire. That's one fire. What about here? Am I able to put this one out too? Second fire. Let's go. All right. Two fires down so far. We're working on our third. Working on the third and... Third fire down. And... Are we able to do a fourth? I mean, we have a little bit of help on this one. But, you know, it's a fourth fire down. We did have help on the fourth one. You know, so I guess we can kind of count that as a half. So, three and a half. Four now because we worked on that one too. And we still have half a tank of water. Oh, my goodness, yo. These modern fire, fire trucks, man, they have water for days, dude. You are not running out of water, dude. That's for sure, man. Oh, my goodness, dude. Look at it, man. This is amazing. This thing is able to do absolutely wonders, dude. Does it... Hold up. Does it have more water than a tanker, guys? If any of you guys have driven in the tanker and used the tanker, you got to let me know in the comments. Does this fire ladder have more water than an entire tanker truck where the entire back of the truck is a big old water tank? Because you got to let me know, guys. Because if it does, then we got to ding it for the realism. Unfortunately, you know, it wouldn't have tanks this big. But... If it doesn't have, you know, the same amount of water as a tanker and has less water than a tanker, then you get a big bonus point for having good tanks. That's how it's going to work. You know, it's up to the comments down below. You're going to have to read them. Or if it's not there yet, then you're going to have to type it. But anyway, guys, let's go on ahead and see how good it backs into one of these garages. And what are you doing, my guy? What exactly are you doing? Oh, wait, there's a guy over there. All right. Well, then we're not going there. We're going back behind the area. Let's see how good it manages to be in this alleyway you know because i know the tiller absolutely impossible impossible to be in this alley Ooh, here we go here we go oh nice we are able to go in but unfortunately we can't actually go into the base so we're gonna see how well it maneuvers in the final test the final fdny test can it park in front of the station okay relax dude the maneuverability dude that's just an absolute plus of how well it maneuvers dude it maneuvers like a car okay well maybe not completely like a car but basically like a car compared to the other trucks look at that we are able to just look at that easily pull in how are we gonna be able to pull out boom 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 there's a fire you hop in the truck you go in here are we gonna be able to do one smooth motion one smooth motion you can get in there easy let's try it in this way let's see right we're pulling in there here right we're coming in we're coming in all right oh the station's full 10-4 heard it on the radio move man and then we come on through here. Look at that one smooth motion. Smooth. Okay, we damaged a little bit, but that was a little bit. That was my fault. That was not the truck's fault. Boom. One smooth motion. Boom. We get a call. Beep, 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 beep. Boom. We are out of there. Look at that. Right down the street. So, yep, this thing is an absolute W fire truck. The only thing debatable is whether or not its tanks are too big for what its chassis would be. But any of you guys... If you guys enjoy today's video and you want to see more, then you have to make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and give a shout out to Tam Roar for wearing the Jenkins Patrol merch. You know, shout out to him. But anyway, yes, share it with all your friends. And I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow or maybe even later today with a bonus video. All right. Bye, guys.